Hi guys, it's Paul again from my arts uh, tutorial channel. Um, today I'm just going to do a couple of really easy uh, for really small children really, but uh, these are quite cool to do with your own kids uh, if you've got children yourself um, or younger siblings, brothers or sisters. Um, I'm going to do uh, a quick dog using the word dog. Okay, um, so for this one you don't need um, anything other than the ability to write dog really, really straightforward, really simple, not joined up writing at all. Um, so we're going to do the stem of the D like this, okay? Um, we're just going to simply write dog like this, okay? I'm going to curve the tail around like that, okay? So, next thing we need to do is, on this stem of the D, we're going to almost do a backwards um, capital letter like that. Okay, um, then, from this stem of the, the, the bottom of the D, we're going to curve it like that. Okay, then over the O and the G, going to be a, looks like a little bridge. Okay, and then halfway down this G, this curve, halfway down, we're going to do another line like that. Okay, then simply from this bottom of the, the letter D here, we're going to do a straight line across to the I, and then we're going to do a line across here as well. Okay, uh, then we're going to do a dot in this in the middle. All right, and we're going to do a dot here as well. Okay, then we're going to have a circle there. Okay, um, we're going to have a little curve there for the mouth. You can see where the dog's coming in now. Um, and then we'll put his collar in like this. And that is your... Um, that's our little dog, using the, the word dog, okay? Uh, when you're shading in, um, or colouring in, I'm going to go use a fine line, Stabilo. Um, so I'm going to go down all of these outside edges before I start colouring in, actually. Um, so there's the letter G, okay? Round. I'm going to do him a little black nose, okay? black nose um, like this, okay. So we're gonna colour it in with our fine liner. You can do this with pencil green if you want to. Um, there's the lines for his collar. Okay. There we go. Curve, these are the ears here. There's the D. We've got the I going around there. That's the O for the word dog. Okay. And we've got a little black dot, a little black dot. Uh, and that is our simple little dog head. Um, you can then colour it in light, light brown. Um, if we colour it in light brown now, um, you can put as much detail into this as you want to now. Different colours if you want to do a crazy coloured dog, you could do. Um, you can add to this, put him some bags under his eyes, put him some fur, hairy fur on the outside of the the dog. Um, seen this on another channel called, um, it's under the website actually called howtodraw.com uh, and this um, this chap is, uh, is really good at illustration and he just shows you really easy uh, ways to draw animals and some of his own he's made up as well, some kind of dinosaur creatures. Um, so I've got to give him credit, we've just kind of stolen this idea from somebody else, but I uh, just thought I'd show you guys on my channel uh, how to do a really simple dog um, using the letter, sorry, the word dog. Okay, so you can all have a go at that, I'm sure. Um, sometimes perhaps make this D a little bit, uh, this curve a little bit smaller for a smaller ear. I don't have to have it as big as I've done it. Okay, the this bit of the this bit of the uh, the letter. Okay, um, 
and then what you could do down here uh, is suggest he's got a body by and it just continues off the off the page if you like or off your drawing just do something like that okay and then a red I'm going to do a red color you could do a blue color you could do a gold color whatever you want to do um, if you if you've got a dog at home and you want to do a different colored color to match your dog um, there we are there is the um, dog using the word dog now the only one the other one I want to show you um, and I'm going to probably do it in this area here um, I'm going to use a, a letter X um, and I'm going to create um, two um, what look like koala bears or love bears okay um, so I'm going to do a letter X uh, here hopefully you can see this in a minute okay so I'm going to go an X like this okay that's all we need to do um, second one second thing we're going to put two straight lines like that and then two curves here and here okay like that all right now what we also need to do is small circles like this okay um, another small circle over here like this don't have to be perfect circles just that kind of shape try and get them the same kind of size uh, then we've got small curves like this okay um, now what you want to then do is bring in uh, this kind of shape and then the same from this side okay and you want these touching like that okay um, and that is our two uh, we'll just do a little smiley face like that and then we're going to use a grey uh, and I've got a silvery grey that I'm going to use um, for this okay um, so you want to leave the the inside of the X's white and we're going to colour in our these are two like koala bears or love bears because they're touching each other holding hands, love each other, maybe husband and wife, girlfriend and boyfriend, boyfriend and boyfriend, girlfriend and girlfriend. Okay, so, um, that's what we're going to do, that kind of effect here, which is good. So that's a really easy uh, way to draw a dog and two little cartoon bears. So we've got the second bear coming in now. Just do this nice and quick. You can do this, take a lot more time than I'm doing on this if you want to. Have a go at this today. This is gonna go out on Friday. Um, forgetting which week of the UK lockdown we're on now um, we've just been told we've got another three weeks at least of um, lockdown conditions where any key workers are out working um, so unfortunately for us that's uh, more time in the garden if the weather's nice um, I don't know what the weather's like today where you are um, I'm going to go around this now with my fine liner across here Okay, I'm going to give them little black noses, so I'm going to use my fine liner for this. Don't forget, go over that curve for the eye. If you do them with a closed eye, it'll look like they're, uh, they're enjoying a cuddle. Okay, these don't have to match, it could be different sized noses. Again, the ears don't have to match because it's, it's a different bear. Um, just make sure those hands or those paws are nice and curved and that they touch 
in the middle. And that is our love bears or koala bears. Um, let's just do a little bit of black around this outside edge here to give it a bit of uh, interest. That's our koala bears or love bears. I'm sure you guys could have a go at, um, at doing that, I'm sure. Um, and the dog was really straightforward, really easy. So this will be loaded up now onto my YouTube channel. Um, if you want to send me any messages, um, if anybody wants to see any more animals, um, just let me know on the, the messages. Make sure you subscribe. We're up to um, 180, uh, 183 subscribers now. We've just gone past the 3,000 views. Uh, that's in just over two weeks, two and a half weeks. Um, which is fantastic news. Um, um, total watch hours up to about 140 hours in total of all the videos. So that's great support from everybody. If you could subscribe, that would really help. Uh, if you could spread the word, that would be even better. Um, get other friends and family to subscribe, subscribe as well. Uh, I think there's a subscribe button on each of my videos. Um, and I'm on Instagram, Paul Bembo Artist, and I'm on Twitter, Paul Bembo Art, and I'm also on Facebook. Uh, I've got a Facebook group, Paul Bembo, um, Paul Bembo Art as well. Um, so hopefully see you very soon, and uh, stay safe out there, guys. Take care. All right, bye bye.